Haven't you seen that saying in Latin in his office? It means the nose knows. <laughs> um, Not smart enough for come back to that one. <laughs> even though Willow, up to this point, has been just as flippant as everyone else about everybody dying. Nice use of the word flippant. Yeah. You should put that in. People should know that you're sometimes intelligent. <laughs> <laughs> because I used the word flippant. <laughs> Yeah, we're always working to not actually have to hire certified school librarians anymore. So you're saying if I'm looking for a job. And with your knowledge of explosives, you're a shoe in <laughs> <laughs> As long as I use the word flippant in the interview. Use the word bloody in a sense not describing something that's actually bloody. <laughs> I want this bloody job. <laughs> not to be flippant about it. <laughs> And in the library, they're raiding all of Giles' books. But apparently they don't find any weapons. Or any droppings left by the students that were held in that cage. <laughs> I feel like I... Let me let me look at the episode list again here. Okay. Because I feel like... Didn't I recently say this was the worst episode in a while? Because I feel like I'm about to say that again. I think you say that pretty much every time. <laughs> <laughs> but she's always wearing such fashionable clothes, it's hard to climb fences in those. Believe me, I've tried. <laughs> Stop. I'm not going to put that <laughs> That doesn't even make sense. <laughs> yeah, see, I'll put that in there, because that's interesting, I think. Okay. That's a nice way of saying I'm dumb. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> interesting perspective. Hmm. Uh, some of that doesn't matter. Yeah. But some of it does. Um, that was very, very profound. I'm surprised they even remembered the quote from that movie. Yeah. <laughs> Remember all of Michelle Pfeiffer's lines? Like, bark, 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 or whatever she does. <laughs> <laughs> Mayor Elbrin takes photos with boys. Oh, well, that makes it sound weird. Um, nah, I'm trying to think of, like, a necrophilia joke here. Wow. Because those are always good. Yeah. Um, I don't know about her, her getting hot and then being like, I the only thing around is this dead body. I think you're on your own for that one. Okay, yeah, let's keep going. Um, <laughs> That's what she said. <laughs> <laughs> and they take a bunch of files to Giles. Nice rap. Yeah, I was thinking, I was trying to think of another word I could put in there, but I don't know. Gotta go miles to get to Giles with those files. I think that would work. I couldn't say it. No, I'm, it. I'm not gonna say it. You say it. It's your dumb joke. And she tells her to... <laughs> and she tells... And she tells her to... And she, <laughs> and she tells her to let go of that ego. That's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> she said since she was right there, she's technically an accomplice. Which, again, doesn't really... Uh... You're just trying to deflect guilt from yourself because of that one time you were next to that dude that robbed that bank and then murdered everyone in it. No, no comment. And then used the money to fund an MLM. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I told you not to bring that up. That sold orphan tears. <laughs> All I know is I'm making $5,000 a week, and you can't. <laughs> and it turns out Wesley is the one listening in. Yeah, I guess you can say that. I was excited to use the word unbeknownst in real life. <laughs> okay, you can say what you were saying. Gawkers wearing their dockers. Go ahead. Trying to open up their lockers. <laughs> Getting ready to go play soccers. <laughs> okay, keep going. Not I'm, with I'm that. I'm trying. The... <laughs> Don't rush me. You're being a, oh, really? Come on. You're being what? a little bit of a mockers right now. No, don't put that one in. That one is dumb. <laughs> Along with some Taken style editing. She has a very particular set of skills. <laughs> Isn't that the line? Is that the line? Yeah, something like I that. I only know it from parodies, but I assume it's actually the line. Didn't you just watch the movie? Maybe. I was so taken with it. Don't put that in. Even though that was good wordplay, that's below my standards. Uh -huh. It needs to be taken out. <laughs> and we cut back to Willow and Oz, and it turns out they had sex. And that's the end of their plot line for this season. No, I'm not, I'm not going to put that Yeah. Out of curiosity, I started looking for reviews of this episode, and they are really, really high. <laughs> of course they are. 
the only people that are going to be writing reviews for an episode three seasons into a show are going to be people who really like the show, except for us, of course. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, what about us? <laughs> yeah, I, I, I don't know. We're the outliers. We're the ones where it's like, what's the point of making this review in the first place, of continuing with this show? <laughs> it's certainly not the revenue, because that's basically non-existent on these episodes. You know, I almost had enough to buy a piece of pizza the other day. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for watching. <laughs> but we've already come this far so we might as well keep going that's depressing yeah um you end it right there <laughs> <laughs>